this is Oatman, and welcome back to another episode of Broken Stone, and I'm here by myself today. Been doing a lot of collabs on Broken Stone. Let me move my mic a little bit closer. Okay, we're good. Been doing a lot of collabs on Broken Stone recently, and um, I know you guys have been wanting some single-player content from that, but uh, been prepping for episode 100 of uh, Oak and Stone, and doing a lot of... Uh, what just happened there? And I've been doing a lot of... Uh, single player stuff as well that you guys have been really digging so at the time of this recording I have 188 subscribers which means there's 12 more till 200 so that's freaking crazy I'm really really loving it also today you may notice that there's a test video that came out I just gotta get the before I can announce this um, or an episode zero of a series if you will to see if you guys like it I'm gonna test uh, and see what you guys' reactions to it is and maybe we'll do it as a series if uh, if you like it, but I, I'm not going to disclose that in case the people involved, because it was an accidental recording, so I'm not going to disclose what it is, and let, let me check if I'm recording this here. I'm not going to disclose what it is unless the people that were involved in, in the video uh, allow me to do so because it was accidental. But anyways, today I'm going to talk about stuff on Broken Stone. Um, so the... Um, Questbook got reset accidentally due to some problems. Some problems, some problems indeed. Um, these problems entail uh, some config stuff, boring stuff. Uh, nothing all too important, but anyways, the quest got reset. So there's a story time quest that everybody is kind of required to follow, and I wasn't really paying attention, but it has a lot to do with the lore. Um, it says 30% completed, but I'm not really completed. It's because of, of the stuff I did previously. So it says, why are we here is the first uh, mission or if quest, if you will. So let's take a look. What is this? Why are we here? I have no clue what happened before the darkness. I remember a strange earthquake, except it was the sky that shook. Perhaps if I cleared my head, I would understand more of what's going on. So 2000, 2000 is where I'm supposed to go. And I get a reward back. So we're going to do a bunch of these quests uh, on camera today so we can get back in the groove of things. And you guys didn't see this quest the first time I did it, um, because the first time I recorded it was on my before, like on my laptop before it killed itself. So uh, there is that. So now we'll be able to go to 2000, 2000. We'll be able to fly there, unlike last time. There's a gas ball in there. Blow up something. So we're gonna fly over to uh, that location. And then we'll uh, we'll do the rest of the missions. I'm really excited about this. Is that a pig with a pig hat? That's brilliant. Um, so I'm really excited about this quest because, or all these quests, because I didn't get a chance to read the story and you guys didn't get a chance to hear the story on my perspective. Um, so that's pretty awesome that we're going to be able to do that in this episode. And what better for a single player episode on the fly than to catch up? with stuff we may not know. Right? That's my logic. So you may be asking why I have two hanging gliders. That is a long story. <laughs> um, I died in the nether and had to get another hang glider so I could get there fastly, if you will. I think you move faster underwater and since I breathe underwater this should be no bother. Whoa, you move way faster underwater. That's crazy. I have no idea why you move faster underwater. That would be something interesting to analyze. But I have a lot of stuff with elbow planned for Broken Stone as well. So um, that's going to be really fun. So uh, I don't usually do a lot of stuff with elbow in the Oak and Stone community. But I do want to get into doing more stuff with him because it's going to be fun. And uh, yeah, got some stuff playing with Jag. Got some stuff playing with elbow. There's a lot of stuff going on in the Broken Stone series. Uh, I always tell people in my videos at least when um, uh, when they do or when they complain that I don't do enough single player content on my uh, channel on like the servers like Broken Stone and Oak and Stone I always say if you want to see single player content go watch my single player obviously you guys have been taking that to heart so awesome anyway um, but Needless to say, this is a single player content episode for so I can soothe your tired, whimsical uh, wants and needs for that. Anyway, so, <clears throat> anyways, yeah, uh, I'm really excited about the new series that might be coming up, assuming Red 
and Jag approve of the test video being released, and I want to see what you guys think of it before we uh, before we just go and do it because it will be coming out when I get my new computer. So in like three or two to five weeks ish, uh, it would be a good date to count on for me to start getting my new computer. And I've got a bunch of other series planned as well of other games that are not Minecraft related. I do have some Minecraft related series as well coming out. So don't fret and don't worry. Uh, let's see. I'm here, aren't I? Here. 39 meters away. Hmm. It wants me to go like to that exact location. Is that that island right there? Visited. Claim reward. Beautiful. So, ooh, double bacon cheeseburgers. All right, what's the next quest? The, okay, so we have to do the Red Jagoon quest. The Old Man 5000 quest, we'll read this. Let's read this. Well, let's go, we'll do them first. We'll do them first. So let's get back to base camp, and then we'll read the rest of these quests and potentially do them. Now, for stuff like Research Red Jagoon, it requires him to be on the server to be able to do that. Uh, but uh, you guys can take my word for it. I have completed that quest already, and I have researched Jag, because um, that's already in my knowledge of uh, things that I've done already. So, um, but you guys can take my word for it. I've researched Jag, so uh, we'll just read the lore behind it anyway. So let's go back to base camp and enjoy. There's a lot of awesome horses out here. I like these horses. Oh, there's a great wood tree. You don't see those all too often. Yeah, you kind of do actually. You need to see. I need to see more silverwood, man. I need to figure out how to infuse with Thomcraft. That's that's crazy. That's crazy stuff. I've I've kind of had it up to here with Thomcraft. If you guys could see, obviously, but you can't. Um, but yeah, I really like the rainbow eucalyptus. That's really nice. So, yeah, it's been a little while since we've done some stuff. Let's go under the water because it's faster. Faster to go under the water so fast now the first time I did this it took forever like it was an actual adventure with Jag that I did we went out there together and we lost or we didn't lose nothing or we didn't we went out and we had an adventure but obviously I can't replicate that because that was on my hard, old hard drive that is destroyed so well it's not destroyed the hard drive isn't destroyed because I'm gonna get all that data back and put onto my new computer once I get it built which I'm really excited about and you guys should be really excited about too because that means things like Skyrim will be able to be back in action and things like um, and I'm really excited about that and better than ever because it'll, it'll have less frame rate issues and things like uh, Five Nights at Freddy's will be back and things like oh it's just I and I'll be back to my old recording software it's just and some new series is that maybe I couldn't have run before on my laptop or even on this Mac for that matter are going to be coming and it's going to be beautiful so I'm excited and I am very very excited that's that <laughs> place I fireball just a second ago but yeah I'm really excited because there's a lot of potential series is coming out and uh, a lot of stuff down the road I'm gonna have a really really beast computer um, so we won't have like any limitations at all so that'll be really nice to be able to have that so yeah, getting back to Jungle Base, we can read the rest of these stories. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm I know we need potatoes, and I know we need wheat. So let's get some potatoes and wheat. Okay, so let's let's say okay. Oh man, five thousand dreams are wonderful. Mainly not. Wait, hold on. Okay, that wasn't a scrolling one. Okay, oh man, five thousand. This is my quest. Okay, and this is the quest that involves me, so this is important. Dreams are wonderful, mainly not having to work hard and do anything. A voice hits the dream. Oatman 5000, firstborn. You must change your ways or all of, all your father died for will be in vain. A bright light flashes, and then everything went dark. Is there any oats around? No? Okay, this will have to do. Beautiful. <laughs> ding, 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 ding. I'm gonna need some of these. There should have been oats, man. If there wasn't, there should be oats in this mod pack. What does the Jag quest need? How many? Five. Okay, that's easy. And how many wheat does the Oatman 5000 quest require? Five. Okay, I can do that. I think I may have five wheat actually just laying around. There's three wheat. Three wheat. Nope. Okay. Let me 
cook these up so we can get those ready. Hmm. Wheat, wheat, wheat. I can't believe there's not oats in this mod pack. We should look that up actually. See if Jag cheaped out. Uh, oat. Nope. Confirmed. Okay. Um, so let's go pick some wheat over here. So we can do this quest. Also, I'm in my scientist skin as well. You see this. Remind you of the Attack of the Bee Team days and the Stupid Tutorials days, which are coming back. Stupid Tutorials are coming back. Uh, probably when I get my new computer. Like I said, a lot of things are being held up. Uh, yeah, I do have, I definitely have new Minecraft series is coming out as well. So if you don't, if you're not a fan of other games and stuff, don't worry because I got that going as well. So I read, did the Oatman 5000 quest, manual detect, claim reward, get the reward bag. Open it. <gasps> What? Is it? Oh dear. Hold on. Metal. This means big things, guys. You have no idea what this means. Um. Oh gosh. Tartarite. Holy crap. I'm gonna be able to get tartarite stuff. What is this? Nine damage, wither one, fire aspect two. Ooh, baby. Oh, baby. Now, is this stuff good? The. Eh, it's okay. It's not as good as the tartarite. But. I can get. That's four. Oh my gosh, I have some tartarite dust. That's like the best you can get. Oh my gosh. Wow. Best loot bag ever. Holy crap. Let's put this on here. Science quet. Okay, that is some sick nasty stuff that we got going for us now. Anyways, we'll get back to that quest. <laughs> uh, Rajagoon. Let's do manual detect. Okay, no, we don't have those yet. It's probably in the furnace. The electronic furnace and then manual detect claim reward that's good enough so we just want to do the story time quest today at least yeah <laughs> meh that's kind of why they're called meh rewards right bleh whatever uh elbow salt okay let's oh no no let's read the jag one just rebuilding the kingdom and i hear a voice rajagoon do you want to undo this tragedy? Yes, I said. Anything to turn back the clock. The voice then spoke again. Then come with me. You must tell your past friends that they must change their ways. A flash of light hit me and I blacked out. Doesn't Jag like baked potatoes? I should bring him some. Yes. Um, now, for those of you who don't know, that the, uh, the, ja or the quests in this book are completely from Jag's perspective. So keep that in mind, because he wrote the quest, he gets the perspective, basically. It's kind of how that works. So it's his perspective, it's his story, etc., etc. Uh, it's in first person for Jag, basically. So we got to get some salt. I'm, gonna, I'm glad I'm catching up on these quests. Salt. How many salts? That's plenty. Back to base camp. And then we can claim the elbow reward, and we can read about what elbow has to say. Okay, let's get away from the cows as much as possible. Go sit as our sit at our researching desk. Okay, now. Nah. All right. Let's see. Elbow. Ha! Elbow, last born of Quet. Leave me alone. Elbow and Oat were fighting. No, I won't leave you alone. Oat stabs his sword into Elbow's chest. Elbow falls to the ground. Quit overreacting. You know you will heal. None of us die. Elbow didn't get up. A new voice appeared. Elbow, last born. You are needed to fix all of this how can i you must go to the past and learn everything goes dark salt you know what el or you know what elbow here yeah yeah <laughs> okay good reward bag beautifully anti-gene woolly not that i really need it but fair enough <laughs> a woolly anti-gene i like my woolly gene 
but okay. Fair enough. Now we need the bean quest. Um, let's see, we need to get some cocoa beans. I know we have some around here. Let me see, there's some cocoa beans. I think five, I think five is for all the quests. These are just kind of side quests. So I want to complete all of these anyways. Three, there's some more around here. I know there is, there has to be. And some right here, good enough. And good enough. We'll read this. Fighting for survival, the new things. Survival games, cops and crims, walls, games all designed for killing other humans. Fighting every day for survival. Bean appears in a bright room with nothing in it. A voice booms out. Bean, I will offer you a chance to survive the apocalypse. You must help the quat born to create a better world. Do you accept? Bean says, anything to get me out of this mess. The bright room envelops Bean and he blacks out the magical fruit. Hehe, <laughs> I know what I can give Bean. Oh, claim reward. Okay, good reward bag. Let's take a look. Golem animation, Golem answers well. Ooh, I think that's pretty good, I guess. I mean, don't know much about Thomcraft, but I guess we'll get there. Those will be beneficial, I guess, in the future. Let's go back to base camp. Our base is kind of cool, I like it. But at the same time, I want to get into some other builds. Okay, I can't believe I am the closest um, to the Tartarite stuff, but anyway, anyways, settling, you are here, no idea why or how, but you had better get some supplies, you may be here for the perceivable future, only noobs don't understand that in order to do anything you must have a crafting table, okay, well I have that, kinda good, meh, it's okay. I'm down with that. And uh, since I completed that already. Nether. All these questions and no answers to be found. Perhaps some research into this world would help. I have noticed these strange orbs around. I wonder what they do. Investigating them should help. Claim. Blocks of iron. That's pretty nice. As the book says. Okay. Strange. Researching nodes revealed that this world... This world is not the real or is not real none of it it is a combination of past present and future dreams and reality i should research the tainted land to learn more i must find the closest tainted region and use my thermometer to research what is there i've already done that so I'm claiming reward marrow eh horse name tag You're good enough i'm gonna spawn this horse in here oh oh <gasps> It's a sign. It's a sign. It's a freaking sign. Hold on. You know what that horse is. Those exact colors. Do they remind you of anything? Some of you older viewers may know. Not older, like older, but like the viewers that have been here a while. Oh dear. Oh dear. Jag's gonna be jelly. Mm-hmm. I found Hossie. Mm-hmm. It's Hossie. Hossie. Okay. Anyways. Right into that destruction. This taint is... Uh, this taint. This is cosmic instability in material form. It also has signs that Jag also has. I wonder what the connection is. I should research Regigum with my thermometer. I already have done that. Reward bag. Got that already. Something I already have. Gosh. Okay. Let's see. More information. Researching Jag unlocked something he remembered more. Unlocked something. He remembered more about why we are here. I think I will talk to him some more and find out more. I will have to take some notes. Where did I put my book? Okay. This is going to be an adventure. Whoa. Like. Okay. I wasn't like. Ah, oh, gosh. Man, that's taking up too much time. Okay, let me look. This is probably not the same kind of episode you're used to, but it's something that is going to be fun anyway. I think, in my opinion. Okay. So we're going to go get some sugar cane. <laughs> that's what it is. I paused for a little while. I need some water as well. There's some sugar cane there. Okay. Good enough. Okay. It seems as though I have the most 
I mean, besides Jag, I have the most lore here. Which is pretty cool, I guess. I guess it makes sense. Because I do the most, I guess. Okay. Punch a log. I'm going to leave this tree floating like a boss. Don't mind me. Don't mind me as I pick up this tree like a boss. And do that with it. Yeah. Okay. Get some paper. Make a book. And a book. And manual submit. Claim reward. Let's see what we got. Amazing reward. Safari net fish music disc. That's not amazing, but it's it's okay, I guess. Alright. Okay, there's more. I remembered why I'm here, but I feel like I'm still missing information. Sigh. I don't know what to do. Killing mobs will make it better. These zombies are plentiful. No one will miss five. Let's go do that. I got the Axe of Blaze Rock, the exact replica from the war. Why not, right? I know where a zombie spawner is as well. <laughs> so, that benefits as well. There's a little X in the water here. And there's a reason there's a little X in the water here. Dun, dun, dun. Conspiracy. Okay. Confirmed. Okay. Alright. Kill these guys. And then we'll get some zombies. Come on. Okay. I don't think we'll be able to claim the reward here. Oh gosh. Mm -hmm. He's down. Come on, zombies. Is that all you've got? I don't really need Ocelot spawn eggs, per se. Okay. Come on, I need more of you. Come on, more, more, more. Let's go. Come on. Come on, party poopers. Come on. There you are. Let me just read here. Three killed, 60% done. It's so dark in here. I don't want you guys to have to look in the dark all the time. But I guess it has to come to that, doesn't it? Oh, yeah, yeah. Don't I have torches? I have some torches. That works. Okay. Quest complete. Okay. GG. Basic reward bag. Bad reward. Caramel apples. That's not bad. Jack doesn't know anything. Okay. The plot thickens. Ooh. Oh, I killed a wither boss. I have to kill one with elbow. But let's read it. Let's read the lore. What happens? Okay. Let's go read what happens. Because this seems like it's going to be a, a suspenseful ending for the end here. I, I do got to kill some withers with elbow. I did kill the, those withers in the last episode with Jag, but I need to kill some more with elbow anyway. So, there is that. I could kill one by myself, but I promised elbow I would kill some of them, so. Never mind that. So let's take a look. Let's read this. This is going to be the good stuff. The plot thickens. The first block it sent us here to fix what happened in my time. We eventually lost our immortality, and without knowing, Oat killed Elbow after that the hostility just continued. We were so used to fighting that we hold on, just ended up killing, and just left, and Oat tried to hold the group together, but from him killing Elbow, there could be no trust. Mike was the first to try to kill Oat, but Oat was the firstborn. Red, in an angry rage, awoke. Herobrine. The demon ripped Red apart and attacked Oat. Oat didn't last long, but he did enough. I was his next target. Herobrine, damaged from fighting Oat, was vulnerable. Even though it took almost all of my strength, I managed to kill him. The blast of his death unleashed a wave of energy that refreshed the world, but he had already picked off the other Oakensoners. I was the last warrior to survive on my own. Stop killing people. Kill mobs instead. GG. Ooh, how deep. Let me check the time on this. 24 minutes. That is good, I will say. That is good. Well, I'm going to call it here. That was a pretty adventurous episode, I think. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please leave a like. If you didn't, don't leave a dislike because it's mean. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye-bye.